Graham's law of diffusion of gases. Objective To understand the basic principles of the diffusion of gases and Graham's law of diffusion. Gas molecules move from areas of higher concentration to areas of lower concentration in a process called diffusion. A Scottish chemist, Thomas Graham, proposed a law that states that the rate of diffusion of one gas through another is inversely proportional to the square root of the density of the gas. This came to be known as the Graham's law of diffusion of gases. This law can be mathematically represented as diffusion rate of a gas R is inversely proportional to the square root of its molar mass M. For a mixture of two gases, this equation is given as R1 divided by R2 is equals to square root of M2 divided by M1. For example, consider two gases ammonia and hydrogen chloride and apply Graham's law, then it gives R NH3 divided by R HCl is equals to square root of M HCl divided by M NH3. Molar mass of HCl is equals to 36.5 and molar mass of NH3 is equals to 17. Now substitute the values in the equation. Square root of 2.147 is equals to 1.465. This reveals that rate of diffusion of ammonia gas is 1.465 times to that of hydrogen chloride. In other words, ammonia gas will travel 1.465 times more than hydrogen chloride gas when they were allowed to diffuse. To study the diffusion pattern of two different gases, Let's perform a simple experiment. We require ammonia and hydrogen chloride solutions. Two small cotton balls. 50 cm glass tube open at both ends. And two rubber corks. Take a cotton ball and dip it in ammonia solution NH3. Dip another cotton ball in hydrogen chloride solution HCl. Place the two cotton balls in the glass tube at the two ends simultaneously and close the two ends of the tube with rubber corks. Inside the glass tube, gases from the two solutions will begin to move in the opposite directions to each other. After some time, ammonia gas and hydrogen chloride gas will meet and react to form a white solid ammonium chloride. Mark the point where the gases meet and form ammonium chloride. Measure the distance D NH3 from the ammonia end and D HCl from the hydrogen chloride end. Ammonia gas will travel a longer distance, 30 cm, while hydrogen chloride will travel a shorter distance, 20 cm. The diffusion rates of each gas will be the distance traveled by each gas. So, 30 divided by 20 is equals to 1.5. Now let's compare the theoretical value from Graham's law 1.465 and practical value from the experiment is 1.5. It is experimentally proved that ammonia gas will travel faster than hydrogen chloride gas. In other words, lower molar mass gas will diffuse quickly than higher molar mass gas. Summary Gas molecules will diffuse from areas of higher concentration to areas of lower concentration. Diffusion rate of a gas is inversely proportional to the square root of its molar mass. Ammonia gas will diffuse more quickly than hydrogen chloride gas.